यू ऑल आर मोस्ट वेलकम इन आवर यूट्यूब चैनल सवाल बवाल आवर क्वेश्चन इज एक्स प्लस अंडर रूट एक्स इज इक्वल टू एक्स बाई वाई एंड वाई प्लस अंडर रूट वाई इज इक्वल टू वाई बाई एक्स वे आर एक्स एंड वाई इज ग्रेटर दैन जीरो देन वी हैव टू सॉल्व फॉर एक्स एंड वाई बिफोर आई स्टार्ट टू सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन प्लीज सब्सक्राइब आवर चैनल एंड प्रेस द बेल आइकन यू कैन ऑल्सो फॉलो अस ऑन टेलीग्राम व्हाट्सएप एंड ट्विटर विच इज नाउ नोन एज एक्स इफ यू हैव एन इक्वायरी रिगार्डिंग एनी क्वेश्चन और यू हैव एनी अदर क्वेश्चन देन यू कैन मेल अस एट सवाल बवाल एट द रेट ऑफ जी मेल डॉट कॉम लेटेस्ट स्टार्ट टू सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन बाय इंस्पेक्शन बोथ ऑफ द इक्वेशन we can say that x is equal to y since as we replace x with y and y with x there is a no change in both of the equation then we can say that x is equal to y by putting the value of y in first equation we will have x plus under root x is equal to x divided by x then this will be equal to x plus under root x is equal to 1 now it can be written as x plus under root x minus 1 is equal to 0 further we can write it as under root x whole square plus under root x minus 1 is equal to 0 let us consider under root x as a t then x uh, x will be equal to t square putting the value we will have t square plus t minus 1 is equal to 0 let us compare with a standard quadratic equation that is ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0 then the value of a is equal to 1 and the value of b is equal to 1 and the value of c is equal to minus 1 as we know that sir dharyachar rule tells us to find the root of quadratic equation that is the minus b plus minus under root b square minus 4ac divided by 2a with help of this formula we will find the root of this quadratic equation let us put the value of b a and c then we will have minus 1 plus minus under root 1 square minus 4 into 1 into minus 1 divided by 2 into 1 by solving it we will have minus 1 plus minus under root 5 by 2 means t will have the two value one is uh, minus 1 plus under root 5 by 2 and other value is minus 1 minus under root 5 by 2 since t is equal to under root x and x is greater than 0 therefore t will be the positive number but this number is negative number since both the number is negative hence we will ignore this solution and we will consider minus 1 plus under root 5 by 2 only therefore under root x will be equal to minus 1 plus under root 5 by 2 squaring both side we will have x is equal to minus 1 plus under root 5 by 2 whole square this can be written as minus 1 plus under root 5 by 2 square and square with the help of formula a plus b whole square and that is equal to a square plus b square plus 2ab will op will open this this will be equal to minus 1 square plus under root 5 square minus 2 into 1 into under root 5 by 2 and this will be equal to 1 plus 5 minus 2 under root 5 by 2 and this is equal to 6 minus 2 under root 5 by 2 and taking 
2 as a common we will have 2 into 3 minus under root 5 by sorry uh, square of 2 will be the 4 this will be equal to 4 and this will be equal to 2 into 2 we will cancel it and this is equal to 3 minus under root 5 by 2 this is our required answer but we have considered y is equal to x or x is equal to y by the method of inspection now let us prove it why we are considering x is equal to y our first equation is x plus y, uh, x plus sorry x plus under root x is equal to uh, x by y and our another equation is y plus under root y is equal to y by x. Let us multiply first equation with y. Then this will be equal to x plus under root x is equal to x by y into y. This will be equal to xy plus y under root x that is equal to x. Now multiply this equation with y sorry uh, with x then this will be equal to x uh, y plus under root y is equal to y into x into x then this will be equal to xy plus x under root y is equal to y consider this equation as a first equation and consider this equation as a second equation and by subtracting second equation from the first equation xy plus y under root x is equal to x and another equation second equation is xy plus x under root y is equal to y we are going to subtract second equation from the first equation then xy will cancel out with this one and this will be equal to y under root x minus x run under root y is equal to x minus y we know that the formula of a square minus b square is equal to a plus b and into a minus b therefore we can write this equation further as y under root x minus x under root y is equal to under root x square minus under root y whole square so under root uh, square and further we can write it as under root y into under root y into under root x minus under root x into under root x into under root y is equal to with the help of this formula we can break this as under root x minus under root y and under root x plus under root y further from this two term we can take the common under root x under root y then this will be equal to under root y minus under root x and this is equal to under root x minus under root y and this is equal to and into under root x plus under root y transporting this term to the LHS side we will have under root x y into under root y minus under root x minus under root x minus under root y into under root x plus under root y is equal to 0. Now further we can write under root x y under root y minus under root x taking minus from this term we will have minus minus will be plus and this is equal to under root y minus under root x into under root x plus under root y is equal to 0. Now let us take common under root y minus x under root y minus under root x as a common then we will have under root y minus under root x into under root x y plus under root x plus under root y is equal to 0 and we know that 
the value of x and y is greater than 0 and therefore this term will be the positive this term will be also positive and this term will be also positive therefore this whole term will be positive and it will not equal to 0 it means under root y minus under root x will be only 0 in this case therefore we can write it as under root y is equal to under root x and further squaring both sides we will have y is equal to x which we have told you that uh, by method of inspection y is equal to x and further by substituting it in the first equation we will derive uh, through the same process and we will get the answer. Now without proving that y is equal to x can we can we solve this uh, equation yes we can solve this equation without proving y is equal to x now let us see this method our first equation is x plus under root x is equal to x by y and our second equation is y plus under root y is equal to y by x. Now let us consider our first equation. With the help of this first equation we can write under root x that is equal to under root x plus 1 is equal to under root x into under root x by y cancelling under root x with this under root x. Further we can write it as under root x plus 1 divided by under root x is equal to 1 by y. Taking reciprocal we will have y is equal to under root x divided by under root x plus 1. Let us consider it as a first equation. Now from second equation that is y is plus under root y is equal to y by x. We can once again write it as under root y under root y plus 1 is equal to under root y into under root y by x cancelling under root y we will have under root y plus 1 is equal to under root y by x. Further we can write as under root y minus uh, under root y by x is equal to minus 1 and we can write it as under root y by x minus under root y is equal to plus 1. Now taking common under root y we will have under root y 1 by x minus 1 is equal to 1. Taking x as a LCM sorry x as a LCM we will have 1 minus x is equal to 1 and further we can write it as under root y is equal to x divided by 1 minus x. Squaring both side we will have y is equal to x square 1 upon or 1 minus x whole square. Let us consider it as second equation. From first equation the value of y is equal to under root x plus uh, under root x upon 1 plus under root x and from the second equation we are having y is equal to x square upon 1 minus x whole square. Let us equate both the value of y then we will have under root x upon 1 plus under root x is equal to x square upon 1 minus x whole square. Now consider under root x as t then the value of x will be equal to t square. Now put the value of under root x and x then we will have t upon 1 plus t is equal to t to the power 4 divided by 1 minus t square to the whole square. Further we know that a square minus b square is written as a minus b into a plus b with the help of formula, this formula we will write it further that is equal to t upon 1 plus t is equal to t to the power 4 divided by 1 minus t 
वन प्लस टी स्क्वायर एंड स्क्वायर एंड टी विल कैंसिल आउट दिस टी टू पावर फोर दैट विल इक्वल टू टी क्यू देन वी कैन राइट वन अपॉन वन प्लस टी एंड दिस इज इक्वल टू टी क्यू अपॉन वन माइनस टी होल स्क्वायर एंड वन प्लस टी होल स्क्वायर कैन बी रिटर्न एज वन प्लस टी इंटू वन प्लस टी एंड कैंसिल इट वन प्लस टी विद दिस वन प्लस टी देन दिस विल बी इक्वल टू वन इज इक्वल टू टी क्यू अपॉन वन माइनस टी होल स्क्वायर इंटू वन प्लस टी नाउ क्रॉस मल्टीप्लाई वी विल हैव वन माइनस टी होल स्क्वायर इंटू वन प्लस टी इज इक्वल टू टी क्यू विद द हेल्प ऑफ ए माइनस बी होल स्क्वायर वी विल ओपन इट दैट इज इक्वल टू वन प्लस टी स्क्वायर माइनस टू टी इंटू वन प्लस टी इज इक्वल टू टी क्यू फर्दर वी विल मल्टीप्लाई बोथ दिस इक्वेशन देन दिस विल बी इक्वल टू वन माइनस दैट इज इक्वल टू वन माइनस टू टी प्लस टी स्क्वायर प्लस टी स्क्वायर माइनस टू टी स्क्वायर प्लस टी क्यू इज इक्वल टू टी क्यू कैंसलिंग दिस टी क्यू विद दिस टी क्यू एंड फर्दर सॉल्विंग इट वी विल हैव वन माइनस टी माइनस टी स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू जीरो एंड इट कैन बी रिटर्न एज माइनस टी स्क्वायर माइनस टी प्लस वन इज इक्वल टू जीरो एंड फर्दर वी कैन राइट इट एज टी स्क्वायर प्लस टी माइनस वन इज इक्वल टू जीरो एंड वी हैव ऑलरेडी सॉल्व द वैल्यू ऑफ टी स्क्वायर प्लस टी माइनस वन एंड विद हेल्प ऑफ दिस फॉर्मूला विद दिस क्वाडिटिक इक्वेशन वी विल सॉल्व द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स हेयर विद दिस सॉल्यूशन वी हैव नॉट कंसिडर्ड एक्स एक्स इज इक्वल टू वाई एंड विदाउट कंसिडरिंग वी हैव सॉल्व दिस थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग दिस सॉल्यूशन प्लीज सब्सक्राइब अवर चैनल टू सपोर्ट एस एंड प्रेस द बेल आइकन डोंट फॉरगेट टू लाइक कॉमेंट एंड शेयर थैंक्स वंस अगेन